Hey guys, Todd here, News for Bait and Tackle. I got a tip for you today on Z-Man on the proper way to rig it. We have put several videos out on this and, and we've seen Z-Man and a lot of other people do as well, but we still have several customers that come in and don't really know how to rig it properly. They get frustrated with the product because it is so stretchy uh, with this elastic material that it's hard to get it on the jig head the way that they're trying to shove it on. So what we want to do is we want to show you the proper way to rig it and a new technique or a new tip that we've seen that Z-Man had just posted uh, that may actually improve the longevity of your Z-Man bait. So check this out. All right, guys. So what we've got here is some of the smaller versions of Z-Man soft plastics that they have. Trick Shot, Jerk Shrimp, and the Streak Z 3.75. The reason I chose these baits is because uh, a lot of our customers and a lot of the people that we talk with have a harder time getting it on small plastics because the front of the baits are so much smaller. So check this out. So when you're going to put this uh, soft plastic to the jig head, you want to lay your jig head over the top of it, which is gonna mock up how that uh, jig head is gonna sit in the soft plastic. And if you see right here at the back of this hook bend, that's where your point's gonna come out. So I'll always take my finger, put it right there, kind of give it a tick mark, where that hook bend was, just like that. And so that gives you a little tick mark on the back to where you can come straight in the middle of the head, straight down the back, and then come right out where that tick mark is. And if you do that every single time when you go to rig this, it'll be rigged perfectly. But check this out. So a lot of people have trouble because this is what they do. They try to force that soft plastic on there and it's not gonna work. So what you need to do, grab this hook just like so, take and pinch this soft plastic just like this, pinch it, pull out and up. You see how that stretched around there? And so what that does is that gives it a perfect inline jig head. Now check this out. This is the new tip I was telling you about that I'd seen uh, on the Z-Man Facebook page, by the way, check them out. Uh, so Z-Man had put this out, uh, someone had created this, and I really like the idea uh, because after you use these soft plastics and you catch, I don't know, maybe 20, 30, 40 fish on them, sometimes right where those big barbs are in that plastic, it will back down off of those barbs because it rips it, you know, from constantly being pulled. Well, check this out. If you'll take another jig head, come right in here, grab a piece of that plastic with your jig head, but take and put it right over your hook eye, just like this. Then when you go to pull it out, be careful because this barb right here will cut that Z-Man soft plastic, just like that. You see how that had grabbed that hook eye? And now there is no way that thing right there is going to pull off. It gives you that slim line presentation that always works. Guys, if you like what you've seen here, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and be sure to check out more of our videos.